So what we train at the school is coaching skills and coaching skills, our training is split up into, you know, you have the conversation, you have the continuum, you have the system, you have ethics, supervision and professionalism and people go out into the world and uh, they coach in the world. And uh, what we're using here is how we can use our style of coaching to improve on the leadership of organizations and developing culture. Now the way the organizations work is it's a top-down approach, it's a command control tell paradigm and the CEO sits at the top of the organization and the customers sit at the at the bottom line. And and what what we want to talk about here is servant leadership and uh, so we've got the coaching stuff done now we're now moving uh, the conversation to leadership and how leaders can use coaching as a skill set to motivate organizations so me as a leader i'm going to be coaching and interacting with you you interact with your teams and your teams have followers or interact with uh, customers and um, and so what I want to talk about is, uh, is uh, the, the training and how you use coaching to go off and become better mentors in organization. And then when you start thinking about leadership, sustainability, succession planning, all that sort of thing. And um, so the second part of the training, which uh, I'm going to be doing with, uh, with uh, existing coaches is around uh, business coaching and how you can use a coaching skill set uh, in servant leadership being a servant leader um, the difference between being a leader and being a manager um, and where you have kind of hit your glass ceiling and you don't know how to break through or your team doesn't know how to break through and then you'll you'll do a breakthrough process with one of our, our, our partners and um, there are two streams to you being developed one is your leadership skills and then the other is the management skills and how those two come together and you as a uh, coach business coach can facilitate the organization in coming up with the solutions to their their challenge so a business coach doesn't have the, the 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 answers to tell the business what they can do the business coach facilitates the business in mentoring and coming up with the solutions to their own uh, challenges if the coach was coming up with the business solutions for the business the coach is actually a consultant and that is uh, then the person showing up in a different role so business coaches go into businesses they work within the systemic environment to improve business outcomes and uh, so the second part of our training is you can uh, learn uh, coaching skills but then how do you go and apply them in the business environment how do you behave in a professional ethical way how do you receive supervision and how as a coach uh, you transition to a business and team coach um, so that's that's what uh, we're going to be talking about in this lecture in this series and um, yeah always comment